My name is Juninho Cabral. I live and work in Rondonópolis, Brazil. When I was born, my grandma hid me away from my parents for two weeks. She wanted to protect me from the rest of the family, especially my mother's side of the family. My mother's side are white, while my father has dark skin color. They were expecting a healthy child born with white skin. I don't know what were they thinking when they saw this body of mine, but it's obviously against their will. Futsal is one love of my life and I'm starting to work as a professional futsal coach just for a month. It was 14 years old when I first played a proper football game and in the same year my little brother Marlius came to this world. Marlius lives with my dad in the farm. Later, I found out that my mother did not give birth to him. He was the son of my dad and the woman who lives in a nearby farm. My mom had totally accepted Marlius as her own child. But I do not know if it is because of my disability. I went to college in 2009. After college, I decided to stay in the city. For all the years, I've been trying to prove myself that I am a man of capability, especially for my family. So I fight. With the help of my friend Rai, I get to work two jobs. Coaching the local football team and be a fitness teacher in race gym. Sometimes, I just forget the miserable and enjoy life. Today, I am going back to Itiquira, my hometown, for another Fushal game. I also invited my family to the game. This time, I want to win. It was not until the second half that my family came. They sat in, in the corner and watched my work. I lost the game again. It was not easy for me when I walked to them. But they all encouraged me and said 
they had prepared dinner for me. My family is waiting for me at my sister's house. We talked and we laughed with the effort I tried to make an understanding of my family. Things have been changed. I will continue to move on, not just to proving myself to anyone. Perhaps someday you can see me coaching the Brazilian national team. <laughs> Só você vá Como se o meu coração fosse feito de aço Pediu pra esquecer os beijos e abraços E pra machucar ainda brincou comigo